Welcome back. The SMH Group Stadium is our setting tonight on Rams TV for Derby County's third pre-season friendly. Chesterfield hosting Derby County. Number 17, our number number. Number 22. I think it'll look a little bit more like a normal game this evening. Be high intensity, they'll be trying to press, getting the ball forward quickly. Hopefully. Early chance for Grigg here. An early save from Josh Vickers, just 30 seconds into the game. Harahan calms things down. It was Bradley that got beat in the end. The last man, it looked like a little bit of a shove, but the referee didn't give it, and then it was up to Vickers to make that save. There's the ball again. You don't see the little shove. As he gets through 1v1, it's a good save from the goalkeeper. Paul Warren likes his players to be fit as fiddles. Williams for Chesterfield. A completely different pre-season for this start of the county squad. Oh, heavy touch from the goalkeeper, Bird was in. And the referee has given the penalty. Well, Max Bird put the pressure on, he's forced the error from Harry Tyra. And Derby will have an early opportunity to take the lead. Easy decision for the referee. Bird does really well to go and press Tyler, the goalkeeper. And as soon as he nicks the ball away, the goalkeeper sticks a leg out and down Bird goes. Penalty without a question. James Collins has the responsibility. And the goalkeeper redeems himself. Penalty saved. Goes down to his right hand side, Collins. Side foots it. Tyler guesses the right way, goes down to his left quickly and makes a good save. Grigg. Support coming from Shackleford. And one back by Bird. He's done that effectively already tonight. Derby may be able to pounce him. Mendes Lang a long way out. Goodness knows why he didn't use Bird instead. Referee's blown his whistle because there's a Chesterfield player that needs some treatment, but a, a strange decision from Nathaniel Mendes Lang there. Bobra comes away with it. Old Clough back to Tom Naylor. Now it's Banks who lines up the drive. Ever testing Vickers in the derby goal. He didn't get the connection he wanted. It was a decent opportunity from 25 yards out. They work it well, Chesterfield down that left-hand side. Naylor plays it back into Banks. The touch was good enough, perfectly into space, and then just drags it wide. Robinson just calling possession. Max Bird looks to have come back for pre-season in fantastic shape, by the way. I was impressed with the physical output in pre-season so far. On the ball here, he's found Mendes Lang in a bit of space. Taking on Clements, running over Clements and drawing the foul from the defender. Ward and Harahan over it. Both have quality. Sonny Bradley lurking on the edge of the six-yard box. In by Harahan to the back post. Passion did everything he could to get there. The wonderful free kick from Harahan, just a little bit too much for Erin Cashin to get on, on the end of. You can see him there trying to go over the top. Finding Joe Ward this time. Ward whips it across, great cross! And it's met by James Collins, who may have seen his penalty saved in the first half. There was nothing the goalkeeper was going to do about that. Derby have the breakthrough. They lead Chesterfield by a goal to nil. It was a delightful goal as well, Owen. Win it in midfield, Max Bird finds Ward on this right-hand side, and we've been looking for one of those crosses where he's got a bit of space ahead of him, and what a cross that is, right on the money. And to be fair to James Collins, 
it wasn't over just because it was a good cross into the box. He had to direct it into that far post, and he did it superbly. Here's the cross, half a yard, whips it in, and it's a glorious finish from Collins, completely unmarked. He finds that little gap in between the two defenders, watches the ball, just nods it into that far corner. A brilliant finish from a quite superb cross on this right-hand side from Ward. Obra has been a handful. Naylor. In comes the cross, and the header from Dobra is saved by Wildsmith. A comfortable one for Wildsmith. Dobra just gets ahead of his marker here, and the ball comes in. It's not put in with real pace, but he does get ahead of Rooney. The foul now, cashing on the Brig, and Chesterfield have a free kick in a decent position. King looks like he'll go for goal. Five in the wall. Ding. Saved by Wildsmith. A decent effort from King up and over the wall. Barraham nibbling at him. Aldeca has to turn back. Clements steps away from Bardell. Mandeville. Dobra. Derby players chasing him. Moves it over to Clements. Clements with a cross. Greg the target. Elected in one hand by Joe Wildsmith. Derby win it back with Bird. Collins forced wide. Joel Brown's in the middle. He's the target! Well, it was a really nice improvised attempt from Dijon Brown. Cross came in from Collins on the left-hand side, and that was not far away from the 17-year-old. Well, I couldn't quite work out what he did here. It's a good ball towards the front post. We'll see it again. He just turns his back a little flick with the outside of his right boot. In the final ten minutes, Chesterfield are searching, pushing for an equaliser. Cross from King, header toward goal. Dobra not able to get in on target. Yeah, should have done better as well. It was a decent ball in, there was decent pace on the cross. It was a good break. See Dobra here, someone's got to stay with that run. Horton steps in field. Craig Bullum can't get to that. As the ball rolls out of play, the referee decides that he's seen enough. Derby have earned a victory in this pre-season clash with county rivals Chesterfield. James Collins had a midway through the second half. The difference between the sides, Collins had earlier seen a penalty saved in the opening minutes of the game. But for tonight, Sean Barker, it's a victory. Derby beaten Chesterfield by a goal to nil.